it's obvious they're just political platitudes for the purpose of personal and political prosperity. Ahead of Governor Greg Abbott's parent empowerment event in Tyler Thursday, school leaders from nine Smith County school districts made it very clear they are against the proposal. I wish we were having this barnstorming tour of Texas talking about and garnering support for teacher compensation and taking care of our retirees. School choice is used by state leaders to describe programs that would give parents state money to send their kids to private and charter schools. These school leaders say the governor's plan, or lack thereof, leaves them with more questions than answers. In all honesty, that choice is really more for people who are already attending private schools. It's not for every student. Not every private school has to accept a student based on who they are. We're proud of public schools because we do that. We do exactly what we're supposed to for every student, regardless of what they need. We believe firmly in the Texas Constitution guaranteeing a general diffusion of knowledge to all public school students free and preserving rights and liberties to all of the citizens of Texas. Tyler School Board President Wade Washman says for years, conservative Christian communities like Tyler have been forced to be less vocal about their faith and points out what he calls a conflict of interest when it comes to state funds going to private religious schools. Why not just allow Tyler ISD to have a Christian choice school that's measured by the same educational standards as all other public schools? And it's accountability that also worries these leaders, saying school vouchers would make for an unlevel playing field. And we don't want to lose any, any monies to those who don't have the same accountability measures that we do. What it would do to public education is if we start talking about vouchers, the available funding for public ed will decrease. And I'm not so sure that the outcomes will improve. Tyler ISD Superintendent Dr. Marty Crawford says the district's relationships with private schools have always been great, but says vouchers have created a heck of a dynamic. Austin, Texas coming down here to Tyler, Texas, to East Texas uh, to disrupt some of that is very concerning for me as the superintendent of Tyler ISD.